on the Saturday night we've been thinking of funny musical memories and it was absolutely no question of who was a star when you were on stage. Oh, I still do the school musicals, trying to follow in your footsteps, but I know if I'm even a quarter as good as you, that's good enough. All the girls are going crazy at school for you, they're like, ah! Arisha, you are sorely missed at home. I mean, the things that you do, the help that you give in general, the advice, you take care of mom, you take care of me. You are a brilliant brother. Arisha, we've been friends for eight years or so, and it's finally paying off because I get free Nando's, free merchandise. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, Hi JB! We're all thinking about you. Everyone's really excited about it at King's. Are you actually in the, uh, the student paper the other day? You're fantastic. Everybody on the street stopping us, telling us. Do you know JV? Or we just want to say, for a journalist! Congratulations, Marvin. Everybody here at DMB are really, really proud of you. We wish you lots and lots of luck. Yeah! Just speaking on behalf of all the cousins, um, we're so proud to be your cousins, and hopefully you guys get to the final, and I'm just looking forward to the after party, to be honest. <laughs> <laughs> we all vote ten times every week, so while you're earning your millions, you better come and pay our phone bills, all right? <laughs> I look up to you as an older brother and as a role model and I want to do as well as you when I'm older because you're doing really well, Marv. Fantastic son, you deserve the very best and I hope you go all the way. Love you lots. Really and truly, I knew you were going to get this far because you and the group are fantastic. Jonathan, you're an absolutely super son. I'm really, really proud of you. And I know that you put in 100% into this. And I wish all you guys well, because together you really are magic. Aston, you've done so well so far. We're all proud of you, and I'm especially proud to call you my son. The memories go back as far as you bouncing about in nappies. And I'm seeing my baby bounce about on the stage of X Factor. So, wow, it's been incredible. Well, Arisha, when I see you singing and dancing on stage, I feel very proud, almost to the point of tears. You've made it clear that your desire to do it is for me. All I can say is thank you very much. But to do it for yourself, that is the main thing. <laughs> No, I'm serious, you did it again. I know, it's a nice one, isn't it? No, you well put done, his boys. picture, Thank my you, picture is him. Oh, did we? Yes, did we get did. Oh. yes you did. <laughs> We were all too emotional by that point, we didn't know what we were doing. Well done, no, boys. thank you very much, So, Molly. Diana and Owen, one of you, it will be <laughs> next week. There's no getting away from you. had to wait a long time, haven't you? Yeah. Right, now, as the big day approaches, there are six acts here who dream of getting through to the final. And luckily, our next guests know exactly how that feels. Please welcome last year's X Factor finalists. It's Ridian and Same Difference. <laughs> Oh, Switch up yeah. on the right. Oh. Um, welcome. Although, welcome back. Yeah. Thank you. This is very strange to me because obviously last year I wasn't sat here, but you know this place very, very well. Is it weird being back? Absolutely. I have that kind of gut feeling as we got yeah. towards Wembley today, but I have to say it's amazing and it all feels like home again. Is Definitely. it all the same faces, really? And are you like, oh yeah, I remember you, I yeah, remember I, you? Completely. Uh, slightly different change around in the studio and everything. Yeah. But, uh, I have to say, guys, tonight was awesome. Mm. They did a good really job, yeah. didn't they? Yeah. Yeah. Well, I've got a little confession to make, because uh, although I wasn't working on the show last year, I have to say, I had a favourite. Uh, same difference, it was you guys. <laughs> In fact, to the point where I went to a party recently, my husband's going to kill me, he doesn't know I'm putting this on the telly, but look what we went as. Look, that's me! <laughs> <laughs> I feel a bit left out. Oh, now. sorry. Aww. Next time. Okay. Next time. <laughs> um, so let's talk about tonight. Um, Ridigan, who do you think did take that justice out of our contestants? 
You know, it's easy for us to come on and to say everybody was great, but in all honesty, yeah. I thought every single act was fantastic. Yeah. You know, and, and I really mean that. So they all did take that justice. I'm sure they'll be proud. Okay. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. How do you think it's different from last year? You guys, do you kind of look at them and go, oh, if they were in our year, maybe we, you know, da da da, oh, goodness, what, what do you think? They, is it a different category, a different lot? Um, I think there's a lot more uh, to it this year. I think there's a lot more different sorts of acts. You know, you've got JLS, yeah. the boy band, really great. You've got Diana, that's really quirky. Yeah. You know, you've got oh, everyone, it's just amazing. And there's all different acts. Like last year, there was a few that were quite similar to one another. So yeah. it's a real open ball game this year, guys. Yeah. We've been going all over the country and literally different areas. You, you say, who do you like? And they all shout different, different names. names. So it is an mm -hmm. open run. I know, definitely. They're all phenomenal singers in their own right as well. And, and, the, and the group, I mean, you have an awesome voice, by the way. Yeah, you do. And Aston. Like, yeah. Straight, straight, straight the, the, vo the voices throughout are just, I think, I should push and say this, but far stronger this year. You think yeah, so than yeah. last year? Absolutely. Well, that's yeah. very nice of you to say. Yeah. Now, you guys, life is just going from great to brilliant to just complete madness. You've, you've both got tours, haven't you? Yeah. Ridian, what's your... I'm uh, you... really looking forward to the tour. It's starting late April 2009, going throughout May. So, uh, yeah, yeah, that's what I love doing is performing live. So I hope people come and enjoy the party with me. I'm sure When's they will do it. And yours will definitely be a party. Yes, yeah, <laughs> it certainly <laughs> will. I'm uh, starting on March the 10th and finishing on April the 8th. We're just going all over the country and we'd love everyone to come along yeah. and see us. I'm sure they will do. And these guys are all going on tour as well. The wow. X Factor, which is awesome. what you did. Any advice for them, how to get through oh, it, what they can expect? You know, that's one of the best things, guys. You are so blessed to be here and you've done so well. We know what you're going through, but the tour is amazing because you, you go to a huge arenas. We played the O2. Yeah. And yeah. To do, you, you learn so much, and that's yeah. what's so great about the X Factor. You know, you learn so much about the media, TV, and the music industry, and touring at these live venues. I just well, you get to yeah. see the people who are voting for you for the first time. As exactly. Well, which must yeah, be it's quite nice. carnage. It's awesome. Um, <laughs> so, same difference, and Ridian, you're both performing later on. Do you yeah. feel nervous? Like, is this the worst place to come back to and perform where it all started? I can honestly say today, I don't feel any nerves at all. I just want to really? go out there and give a great performance. Yeah. Oh, well done, I, honestly, you. <laughs> we know that nobody can be harsh to us this year, and That's everyone's going to be positive, so it's going to be great. <laughs> no <laughs> judges. No, no Louis Louis judges to say anything <laughs> mean. What about you? Are you a bit nervous? Yeah, slightly you? apprehensive. Right. You know, the first time we're coming back after 12, 12 months. And you're I'm, on your own, aren't you? You haven't got your sister with you. <laughs> well, well, quite, yeah, but <laughs> you know, the, what I'd say is uh, great to be invited back, you know, usually yeah. the winner comes back, we did, unfortunately didn't win, but we, you know, we're still back here and I'm mm. just going to enjoy every moment. Yeah. yeah, and it must be quite nice for you guys to see that, you know, if you maybe don't go on to win the competition, there's still life beyond it, you know, you guys have done incredibly well. Thank you. Um, what about um, the judges? Do you think they've got tougher this year? I mean, after tonight, do you think they've sort of... I think Louis is certainly tougher, yeah. isn't he? I think uh, I he's having a go at everybody this year. I know. And it was only us last year, so everyone's sort I know, of taking it was the... on you. You took the heat yeah. off everybody last week, didn't you, from Louis? I think the judges try and be, in, be as honest as they can. Yeah. But I think sometimes they just like to have a dig at one another more than they do the acts. So I, I wouldn't take it as mm. offensive, any of you. Just take it as, you know, yeah. they just like to have a go at one another. Mm. <laughs> well, look, guys, thank you so much. I can't wait to see you perform in the results show over on ITV1. It's going to be fabulous. So, Ridian and same difference. Thank, thank you. you. Right now it's time for another break, don't disappear because we'll be catching up with George Sampson, Stephen Mulhern and Craig David and Louis Walsh and Shay Bylan. It's going to be brilliant. Oh, see, what's that? There's a turkey on as well. Dust and turkey, of course, Owen. <laughs> see you after the break. Factor Dan, did you know that today is Chris Doran's birthday? And did you know that Chris Doran is an Irish singer? And did you also know that Chris Doran, the Irish singer, represented Ireland in the Eurovision Song Contest in 2004? And did you know that when Chris Doran, the Irish singer, and represented Ireland in the Eurovision Song Contest, it was in Turkey? This, ladies and gentlemen, is what we call a seamless link into our extra special, for one night only, Irish panel featuring Shay Filer, Louis Walsh, and Dustin the Turkey! <laughs> Can I just say? How are you? I'm fine. <laughs> she doesn't have a moustache. You're wrong, Shane. She's oh, actually being oh, gorgeous. Oh, oh. She Shane told me you were the moustache, Holly. I was saying you're the most beautiful bird in television besides myself. Because... Just in the turkey, watch where you tread, because I know Shane would never say anything like that. I would like never that, say would that, would that, Holly. Okay, no. it's just hairy legs, wasn't Dustin, it? Dustin, 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 now come on. Is he always this cheeky? Yes. 
Very much so. That's why we love him. He's, 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 he's real. He's 